fashion sewers, I hope you are well. If you're new to my channel, I'm Colleen Julie, and on my channel, I do sewing techniques, refashioning of old or even new clothing, and this segment where I show you outfits that I have designed, pattern drafted, and also sewn. So today's outfit is this cute top. Oh. Yes, I also make a skirt as well, and it's a long pencil skirt. But it's this top that I am crazy about. Look at those sleeves. I mean, oh, gorgeous. Quite simple to do, really. And this collar effect that I've got going on here. Oh, this is this is all experimental. It really is. And these are scrap fabrics. Um, as some of you may know, I do like polka dots. Um, I don't. I, I, I think it's, it's, it's definitely a reflection of my childhood and I do remember my mum making me and my sisters um, a red polka dot dress that I must have fell in love with when you know, I was younger and couldn't, you know, couldn't put it aside, I had to wear it everywhere. Um, but yeah, I love polka dots. So, and there's also polka dots on the sleeves as well. Can you see? I love the colour. Smaller polka dots. And like I said, these are scrap fabrics. And this is what I managed to get out of the scraps. And this here is very experimental. There's a, a wire that's going through this. Um, this collar effect that I've got going on here. So what I did was ruched it. And yeah, and put some wire in so it can be adjusted. And I have a flower. So I've got this flower here. Now this flower was, compared to the one that I wore last week, was it? The, the animal print one. As you can see, you can get, get a bit closer. There's a lot more fullness to this, which has a little bit to do with the fabric. And also that I, um, I cut this, um, so the, the fabric scrap was circular and misshaped circle and all I did was cut around it like a spiral and then I experimented with coming up with a very fluffy looking flower and just put it on a strip of um, fabric that I had left over and there you go. How cute is that? So yeah. But I am happy with how it's turned out and I definitely would make another top like this. Um, the sleeves are just, it's just a straight set in sleeve and it's just a nice occasion that's gone to their look. But it's, it's the back that's the biggest concern for me. Um, because there wasn't enough fabric to do what I wanted to do with it, um, I, I think I put it down a little bit too low and you can see that. And the main reason was for that is because I definitely wanted as much as this around the back, but um, I, I didn't want it up in my hairline, if that makes sense. Oh, my twists are coming out. I didn't want it up in my hairline, so around, you know, I didn't want it to be up here, so it'd be irritating sort of thing. I'm not sure. If, it's, it's worked because I didn't want it to do that, but I may have put it a bit too low, I think. Or maybe I just needed more fabric here. I think, so I'm gonna have to play around with this again when I find the time to make another top like this. So cute. Oh, and the skirt. Yeah, the skirt, the, the top's quite new. It's probably a couple of years old. No, it won't be any longer than that, but the skirt's are a lot older than that. And it's just a straight pencil skirt, which I'll show you now. So it's a high-waisted skirt. Um, and it's a crepe. I think it's probably a crepe, actually. Um, like I said, I've made it ages ago. And I've got these light little ties at the side. And maybe I should knot it because I do tend to come undone. And I always have the problem that they never quite look the same. You know, happy with this one. It took me ages to do that one. And all it basically is, is just me going, 
like that. I just couldn't quite get it, yeah, the right way round. Anyway, let me show you the back as an invisible slip zip to it and a back slit. And wear it with white slim back shoes. So yeah, there's nothing, there's nothing more to say other than that. I think it's a good, it's a good match um, as far as design is concerned. Oh, my jewelry, my jewelry are is earrings, clip, clip on earrings, and a a beaded pearl <laughs> bracelet. That's all I've got. Um, I'm just too excited about my top to put on anymore. I don't think I need it anymore. Maybe a, a blue bag, um, which I don't have. I don't think. <laughs> um, but my ears, my ears. Uh, it's a scrubby. That's why I don't have and um, why I wear clip ons. And the reason being that when I was younger, about the age of 12, 13, um, myself and my middle sister um, had, our, had our ears pierced and mine got infected and yeah they just swelled up and got really red and sore and it's like oh no this is not for me so I've always worn um, clip on earrings ever since and um, so that's the reason why. So that's my jewellery, that's all I'm wearing today. I'm just, yeah I'm just in love with my top. <laughs> I didn't want to put any other accessories with it. Um, yeah, the focal point is all of this top here. Yeah, so, yeah, I really am happy with the way it has turned out. I just love this. And the wiring that's in there, it's, I haven't, I haven't stitched on this. So what I did was I twisted it over and then I did a whip stitch all the way around. It took me some time, but it's definitely worth it. Yeah, definitely worth it. So I'm happy with that. Yay, I'm happy. Anyway, um, if you are new to my channel, please don't forget to subscribe. Because if you subscribe, you get lots of video tutorials on sewing techniques, um, refashioning ideas, and you also get ideas from what I have design patterns and also so and so a lot of the techniques that are on my channel you will find that I've used these techniques in the garments that I show in this particular segment so this is the kind of professional um, makes that you can achieve by using some of the techniques and making the right choices with fabrics and yeah if you do like my channel then please do subscribe it is really worth it and if you also want to make a comment in any of my video tutorials, you're also welcome to do so as well. And please do give this form this please do give this video a thumbs up if you enjoyed it. And I will see you next time.